Hi everyone, Meissner here again. This time, uh, like I told, it's a bike video because uh, I haven't driven my bike over two months or something because uh, it still has the problem uh, with the first cylinder and it's not uh, running very good. Uh, now, it's uh, right now it's seven o'clock at night and uh, it's uh, getting darker, but uh, my friend uh, said that uh, I can uh, take the bike to him right now. And uh, he will uh, investigate what's the problem. I hope the problem is small, that uh, I don't have to <laughs> pay a lot of money to fix it. I hope it's not tiny. <laughs> but uh, now I will uh, take the cover off and uh, let's see, will it start? Because uh, like I said, I haven't started it for a long time. Let's try. Will he start it up? And I'll take the lights off just in case. Some light is on, <laughs> some energy is on, but let's hope. bike is uh, on the workshop and uh, we have uh, a small idea what is uh, wrong with it but uh, let's hope uh, it that's the problem because uh, that's the cheapest one but uh, now I will uh, head back home and uh, take out these uh, clothes because <laughs> it's uh, very warm right right now and uh, I'll uh, Continue when uh, I will get the bike and I have more info about this and uh, for you it's uh, maybe a few seconds But uh, for me, it's uh, maybe one week <laughs> But uh, let's go. So it's been uh, over uh, well, It's almost uh, two weeks past when I took the bike to my friend's garage and uh, Now the all the problems are sorted. There were two problems uh, what were uh, causing it my friend is driving and uh, we're driving his uh, Subaru uh, BRC. Uh, it's a uh, very bumpy ride. <laughs> it's uh, hard to film uh, when the car is uh, so tight. And also when the when I'm uh, sitting here uh, I have my uh, suit on and uh, it's uh, very tight in here. <laughs> my son is uh, on the back seat and uh, there's no room uh, for his legs. <laughs> 
so he took the shoes off and uh, he's holding his uh, feet uh, on the seat because there's no room <laughs> but uh, now I'm uh, heading to the bike and uh, let's uh, see uh, what's the noise uh, comparing to the previous one the previous was like a V2 and uh, now it should uh, sound like a true GSX-R but uh, let's go and uh, let's see what's the result I got my baby back and uh, we took it outside we little, uh, let it uh, warm up a little bit and the uh, sound is uh, totally different it's not a V2 or a straight 3 anymore it's a straight 4 now and uh, it uh, should have its uh, full potential I'm uh, <laughs> afraid to drive it a little bit but uh, the problems uh, with the bike there were two problems uh, one uh, was the sensor what uh, regulates the air pressure and uh, it was uh, <laughs> uh, holding uh, with uh, two, uh, two threads uh, of wire on it and uh, it wasn't uh, giving a good contact and uh, the main problem uh, why the first uh, cylinder wasn't working was the injector and uh, like you saw before, uh, I had the problem uh, with the uh, rust on the tank and uh, when I cleaned it up, uh, some uh, rust uh, got uh, past the filter and uh, got uh, on the first injector. There were uh, small particles uh, of rust uh, on the first injector and uh, that was it. Uh, it uh, let some gas in, but uh, uh, when my friend took it out, uh, off, uh, it was... Uh, it was signs, uh, there were signs uh, that uh, there weren't a uh, good uh, comb combustion uh, on the cylinder. It was a little fogged up and uh, now it, uh, it's all clear. I will add some pictures about the job. Uh, when he took it all, all apart, uh, you see the wire, what was holding on the sensor and uh, everything else. And, rear tire was completely worn out and uh, my friend uh, bought a new tire and uh, got it uh, put on and uh, he tightened the chain and everything else uh, what is needed so let's uh, start it up and uh, let's hear uh, what is difference between the old one and the new one quietly it's not uh, cracking uh, like a V2 like uh, like a Harley or something it's uh, running like a bike and uh, now I'm uh, heading home and uh, I uh, hope the driving experience is also good but uh, now I'll head home and uh, uh, we will talk then uh, when uh, I'll get home I made it back home the drive was amazing I was uh, forgotten uh, how the 1000 Chixer feels it was uh, like uh, driving with a 500 before it doesn't have didn't had uh, power before but uh, right now when I push the throttle it uh, flies like a rocket <laughs> it's a uh, mom momentum and uh, I'm very happy that uh, my friend uh, got all the problems sorted out but now I'm uh, heading back, uh, I'm heading uh, inside and uh, getting uh, finally something to eat because uh, it's been a long day and uh, I didn't have time to eat something but uh, like usually if you uh, uh, like this hit like, hit subscribe and uh, feel free to write comments I will answer them when you write them and uh, see you soon on the next video
Bye.